The compressor requires uh, clean air, which is dust-free, because dust entering the compressor will uh, get into the oil system. You will then mix fine dust particles with oil. And the result is a really, really effective grinding paste, which proceeds to wear away the pistons and other moving parts inside the compressor, and it can happen quite quickly. Okay. How does the spin filter system from RTS Africa work? Basically, we have a whole set of small cyclones. Um, the, the principle of that is, is very well established in engineering. Uh, most cyclones are quite big, um, which puts a limit on their uh, particular resistance uh, efficiency. Uh, these particular uh, spin filter vortexes are designed at an optimum size uh, in order to get maximum dust arrestance uh, with optimum pressure drop across the, the spin filter. It is a bit higher than uh, an average cyclone. We, we have a pressure drop of around about 400 pascals in a standard system. And uh, the dust is caused to spin by, by fixed veins on the intake side. The, the uh, particles are then thrown to the outside of the vortex by the inertial forces. Uh, they pass through a, an annular exit um, aperture into the, the um, space within the module and the clean air goes out of the middle of the vortex and out on the other side. The air that has been accumulated in the, in the module, which is now dust laden, is kept in flight by a secondary blower or fan, depending on the size of the thing, and returned uh, to atmosphere or to its source, wherever that may be. Where are some of the latest spin filters from that RTS Africa has installed? We, we have spin filters on, on most of the major mines that are doing development at the moment, uh, mainly on e-houses, MCB rooms. Uh, we also have installed a couple of quite uh, large compressor intakes recently uh, in uh, plants that uh, run large size compressors. They're not that practical for, for tiny compressors, but any, any plant using a large compressor, this is an ideal solution uh, to, to dust removal. What are the particle sizes that spin filters can filtrate? The uh, basic specification states that we will remove 98% of all particles 15 microns and bigger. At 10 microns, we're pulling between 90 and 93% and at uh, 5 microns about 80 percent and at 3 microns virtually nothing. Uh, the graph drops off abruptly uh, below 5 microns uh, because uh, particles that small do not behave like particles, they behave like molecules. Okay, is there anything else you would like to add? Uh, just that the uh, uptake of this technology has become quite rapid and they have found particular uh, acceptance in applications like variable speed drives, which have always been a problem because they convert roughly 3 to 4 percent of the energy that they are controlling into heat, and that heat needs to be disposed of. And trying to do that with air conditioners and, and other uh, similar devices is very expensive to install and very expensive to operate, whereas a spin filter can uh, provide dust free air uh, continuously at very little cost. So they found a lot of acceptance in, in that particular application.